Welcome back. Pilan Citizens Forum has accused the government of being hand in glove with the builder lobby. They say the building construction regulation notified in 2010 is in direct contravention of the TCP circular issued in 2008. They say the government is out to destroy the village identity by allowing mega projects through this regulation. Pilan Citizens Forum has demanded nullifying the Goa Land Development and Building Construction Regulations 2010. Conclusion Asa that this government has been under the pressure of builders and real estate lobby and have gone back on its own word. Government should immediately see to it that this building regulation amendments made to nullify the effect of that circle should be undone. They have threatened to go to court if the government does not nullify the regulation. We are examining it in law. We have seen this, we have seen this, the moment we have seen this, we have put it before the person. Our reporter Jason Suarez with video journalist Omkar Falari. Due to the dense fog on Monday morning, a ferry boat in Mandovi River got drifted for more than an hour, causing a lot of inconvenience to the commuters. The ferry boat was commuting passengers between Shoraon to Ribandar. Ferry almost reached near Mandavi Bridge when it was supposed to reach the Ribandar jetty. This ferry boat named Durbad got stranded in Mandavi River for more than an hour. Fog was dense on Monday morning. Sources say ferry boats mostly don't ply on big roads when there is low visibility. But this ferry ventured into Mandavi River and lost its way. Instead of reaching to Ribandar jetty, it went towards Mandavi Bridge. School children and other people were commuting in this ferry boat. There are just three ferry boats from Soden to Ribanda route. When this ferry got stranded in Mead of Mandavi River, officials of River Navigation Department quickly reached at Ribanda ferry. Ferry movement on this route was also temporarily stopped. When the boat reached back at the jetty, ferry traffic was normalized. Many school children reached late for exam as they were travelling in this ferry. Workers of the ferry boat refused to speak on camera, but they said that intense fog was the main reason why they lost the way. When contacted officials of Captain of Ports in Panji, they said that they will try to get the report on the incident. A senior reporter from Panji, Rakesh Kanurkar. People from Savarde have opposed the bypass from Dade to Kapshe in Savarde. Locals claim that around 200 houses will be demolished due to this bypass. They have demanded scrapping of the bypass. People from Samorde had a meeting on Monday. They are opposing the proposed bypass from Dade to Kapshe in Samorde. They claim that around 200 houses in Fonkule and Anandwadi will be demolished because of the bypass. The survey plan shows that the bypass will be 30 meters wide. The plan is also notified. Locals have now demanded scrapping of the bypass. A reporter from Margao, Samir Bhatt. Let's take a short break. Stay tuned.